Minimize non-productive time at the well site. All right. Well, I would have to say that this all looks good on paper, but how does improved planning translate to increased efficiency, uh, say, at the well site? Well, Veronica, I'm glad you asked that because while we're talking about planning, you know, it's all uses that you can't execute. Let's look at how some of our how our process can alleviate or uh, deliver performance and peace of mind with regards to salt drilling. You know, we can bring an integrated plan to the table that optimizes the right bit, the right fluid, with the right drilling system. You know, it was just over a decade ago, operators did all they could to avoid drilling through salt. But today, we can make salt drilling just as common as any other part of your project. Let's take a look at these numbers from an exploratory well in the Gulf of Mexico's Mississippi Canyon, where we helped an operator drill an 11,530 foot section of salt. And we were able to man it, uh, maintain 79 feet per hour throughout that entire section. That represented a 34% improvement in the planned AFE for that customer. And using our auto track system, we were able to maintain a near vertical wellbore throughout, simplifying casing and completion runs. At the end of the day, this represented over a five and a quarter million dollars in savings per the client on this one project. Well, that's pretty amazing. Now, I heard you right, five and a quarter million. That sounds like you really have salt drilling down to a science. Well, we do. But salt drilling, as you know, is just one of the many challenges we face in deep water.